Where is everyone? It's late. While we are alone, I want to discuss something with the two of you. Yes? I have been running this hotel for 25 years. I have never seen two people dying. And in two days. And two heart attacks. This is just impossible. I agree with you, Arno. It's very unusual, to say the least. Do you believe it is possible to simulate a heart attack? I believe it's quite possible, yes. And who would be able to do so? Someone with medical experience? Exactly. Now, two people were missing at dinner this evening. Ulla and Dr. Hartman. We found Ulla dead in her room. Did you find Dr. Hartman? Yes, I did. And he acted odd. He asked me what happened to Ulla. And when I informed him of her heart attack, he murmured, That sounds correct. I think he is somehow involved in all of this. I agree. But what should we do? I have an idea. If Ulla's heart attack was brought on, then we will probably find something in her room to prove it. We should also examine her body. Let's go then, shall we? Yes, we'll need a magnifying glass. Do you have one, Otto? Oh yes, it should be, somewhere in the kitchen. Anna, can you go and find it? We will wait for you in Ulla's room.
found a magnifying glass. I found it. Great. Look here. Check Ulla's neck. I think someone injected her. Please, let me. See? She was definitely killed. I'm sure about it. By the way, do you see that liquid on the floor? Yes. Judging by the smell, I would guess it is some kind of acid. We need to pour some baking soda on it. You can find soda in the kitchen. some baking soda. Try pouring some baking soda onto that liquid. What did I tell you? This is acid. I am sure it was somehow used to kill poor Ulla. And Professor Kinski, do you think he was killed as well? <laughs> That's a good question, Anna. I think we should go and examine his body. See, there are marks on Professor Kinski's neck also. These marks. Hmm. Yes, Anna. These are the same marks we found on Ulla. Professor Kinski has also been murdered. But why? That is something we must find out. Let's inspect his luggage. I can't open it. It has a strange lock. Let me try.
found a coin. Have you found anything yet? It is all very messy, as if someone was looking for something in a hurry. Yes, I'm sure it has been tampered with. And look at the coin I found. It is very unusual. I've never seen anything like this. Anna, could you show it to Professor Clark? He might know something about it. What is his research interest? Oh, Professor Clark, he's one of the brightest archaeologists of our time. He is studying the Indian occult. And if anyone knows anything about this coin, it will be him. What do you think, Walter? I'm pretty sure both Ola and Professor Kinski were murdered. I just don't know why. The killer is among us. Due to the snowstorm, nobody could enter or leave the hotel. I agree. So, who do you suspect? Dr. Hartman looks suspicious to me. Think about it. When Ulla was killed, he was also missing. When we went looking for him, he wasn't in his room. But Ulla was killed on the second floor, and Dr. Hartman could not go up the stairs in his wheelchair. What if this is just a cover-up? Dr. Hartman looks very suspicious. We should keep an eye on him. I agree. Agreed. Good morning, Anna. Breakfast is ready. Good morning. I'm coming. Good morning, gentlemen. Sorry for the delay. Good morning, dear. That's perfectly all right. Professor Clark, I have been told you study ancient Indian religions. I am very proud to be considered an expert in my field. Can you? So many breakthroughs have been made in recent years, and the general public is not even aware of them. These matters are of the greatest importance. Take Vedism, for example. Do you know anything about Vedism, Anna? To be honest, no. Ah, you see? And what is so important about Vedism? Well, let me put it this way. On my last expedition to northern India and Tibet, I found something of great power. A recipe for an ancient Vedic ritual drink, which was lost for thousands of years. And what is so exciting about the recipe? As they say in Rig Veda, we have drunk Soma and become immortal. We have attained the light the gods discovered. I don't understand. Immortality! I have discovered immortality in a drink, Mr. Peterson. At least, that is what the ancient scripts claim. And does it actually work? I don't know yet, but a new breakthrough could change everything. Blasphemy! I don't believe in any of these tales. They are myths and nothing else. I am not trying to convince anyone of anything. But this might be one of the greatest discoveries of all time. Let me show you. Anna, could you please fetch me some alcohol? Look in the cupboard, Anna. There should be some there. All right.
some alcohol. Ladies and gentlemen, what you're about to witness is extraordinary. Behold the beauty of Soma. Anna, pour some alcohol onto the tablet and set it on fire. But nothing has happened. Ah, yes. My memory plays games with me sometimes. We need a special Hindu coin. And I don't think I'll find it quickly. I think I have one. Where did you get it? It's a long story. Should I put it there? Please do. 